electric field for a infinitely long uniformly charged wire. For this case as well, we first consider a point P located at a distance R from the wire and we'll need to imagine a Gaussian surface. To do that, we have to consider several points around the wire, each at a fixed normal distance from the wire. By doing this, we obtain a cylindrical curved surface with a height h and a radius r. This surface is closed from the top and bottom and is perpendicular to the wire at every point, resulting in a constant electric field intensity on the surface because every point on the surface is at the same perpendicular distance from the wire. We know that for this uniformly distributed positive charge on the wire, the electric field will be radially outward in a certain manner. 